While the full House, including Republicans, still need to make an official vote, but after last night's caucus, it's all but certain that Nicholas Mattiello will be the Speaker of the House. Now, all 75 representatives, Democrats and Republicans, will do so on the first day of the session on New Year's Day. However, there's still opposition to Mattiello remaining Speaker. Now, protesters showed up outside the Chapel Grill in Cranston, where House Democrats held a closed-door caucus. Inside, 21 people voted against the Speaker. Now, some of those on the opposing side came outside the meeting to tell us why, but as Speaker Mattiello pointed out, two-thirds of the caucus still support him. It makes no sense to have a dictatorial democracy. It makes sense to have a representative democracy. And that's what it is that we're fighting for. And I think it's very telling that a lot of us here are women um, because, as a general rule, the Speaker of the House does not listen to the women vote. There's a group of progressives that don't support me. I will continue. I will continue to work to reach out to them and work with them and address concerns. But my focus is always going to be on jobs and the economy and moving our state forward. Now again, that vote came down to 44 to 21, but we'll hear more from last night's protesters and why they think Mattiello isn't right for the job. And that's coming up at 530. For now, reporting live at the State House, I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.